Hello, hello, my beautiful boos. I have Gershon's Poly Gel Nail Kit Enhancement that they asked me to review. So I'm super excited to review this for you guys. Um, I did a thermal set and I already did one of their uh, dip powders and I also did a previous Poly Gel Kit uh, for them and they sent me this one to review so I'm excited I'm going to be doing these on my own nails today and we're going to be using our dual forms in this kit to see if we can complete a full set with this product. If you turn it over it tells you a little bit about Gershon, tells you eight years in the making, it tells you also the expiration date. It has a 24 month expiration. Um, these are, um, I'm assuming this might be, I don't know what that is. So, let's open this kit. They are such a lovely company, guys. I absolutely love Gershon. I love all their products. Everything I have ever tried for them has been so great. Like, I have not been disappointed in any of their products. And, and that is giving my full, honest opinion. Um, I always do in my videos. If I don't like something, I will absolutely tell you guys. If I love it, I will also tell you guys. Because I feel like I want you all to trust, you know, I want you guys to trust me in my opinion. That doesn't mean that everybody will love this kit or this product or whatsoever. It's just my honest opinion. Um, I really do enjoy this company. And if you're looking for a great poly gel, this poly gel is absolutely amazing. So, when you see this kit, you're going to get your little card here from Grishon. It says, thank you for my dear. And on the back, it just tells you how they are excited for you trying their products. So, they can't wait to see what you create. And it gives you their Facebook, their Grishon, and their um, Outlook email. So, that way you can email them. Also, you get this pamphlet right here with your kit. It is taped to the box. I don't know. Okay. There is take to the box. Let's see there. Okay, this is dancing with your nail. It tells you to file clean uh, your edges. It tells you how to apply a thin layer of base gel. How to um, put it inside your dual forms. It tells you how to apply and mold. How to cure for 30 to 60 seconds. UV LED. Then remove, wipe, remove the sticky layer, and then apply the nail mold. But that's just a little pamphlet to help you out if you've never used poly gel before. You get these amazing files, which I love so dear. I absolutely wish they would come out with just that you could order just their files because their files last forever and they are washable. They are 180, 100 grit. Uh, they are amazing. I wash and sanitize mine every day. <laughs> they, I've got like three of them now and I literally use them all the time. But I wish that you could buy them in packs. But make sure that if you're reusing them that you are sanitizing and washing those thoroughly. Because you don't want to cause no bacteria or germs or nothing. And if I use them on myself, I definitely don't use them on clients. I just use them on me personally. In this kit you also get, if I can get it open. Now, I'm not too crazy about the um, see-through bottles. Uh, they look black, but um, let me see. They might, they did change them in their last kit. They're white, and I was so happy for that. But the first kit that I ever got was a see-through bottle, and these are see-through. So make sure that if you're using these bottles, that if you're curing, that you set these other ways because they will cure completely in your life if you are not careful. But you get a base and a top coat in this kit. And I'm just going to set these up above me here. That way I don't leave them on the table so they won't get cured. You get a pack of dual forms in this kit. And I absolutely, these are my favorite dual forms. Um, I used to love the um, other ones. I cannot remember what the name of them is at the moment. But these are absolutely amazing because, and I'll show you why when I go to use them. You also get 
a poly gel tool in your kit the standard poly gel tool and you get a clear and these are 30 milliliters each one of these two which I think is outstanding that you get that much product in this kit so they are well worth the price um, they may seem a little expensive to you but I promise you that if you buy this kit these poly gels will last you forever um, you get a white you get a natural pink you get a dark pink and you get a cover pink and you get a bean red I adore the bean red it's stunning guys and that's the one that we're probably going to be using today in this set because I love the bean red now I'm not going to open all of them because I'm doing a set. This set is going to be part of my Valentine's collaboration with May Nail Designs. So make sure to also go check her out after this video. But we're going to be doing this poly gel kit. And then after the poly gel kit, I'm going to do a video with uh, a design with uh, this uh, set that's going to be for my Valentine's collaboration. So like I said, I won't be doing all of them on my hands. I'm just going to be doing the bean red. After that, um, I'll do a Valentine's collaboration video for you guys. And then I will review every one of these poly gel kits. Or tubes of poly gel, I should say. Let me know what you think down below of Gershon, whether you like them or not, if you have them, if you have not used them, or if you have used them. What's your favorite color in the poly gel set? And, and let's jump into this video so it doesn't take forever. But I'm going to be using the Bean Red because I absolutely adore it. But let's talk a little bit about these dual forms. These are my absolute favorite, guys. Like, I adore these. I do wish they come in a little tiny um, box that way they were sorted out but it's okay if they don't I mean it's not really a big deal but talking about the dual forms now here's what I like about dual forms first of all it has the little grids here to where you can measure your poly gel out also has the little tools here to where you can hold this part of the poly gel and you actually don't have to hold the actual dual form itself and get it all over your hands you can actually just hold on to these but I also like this is my favorite part right here the most uh, forms don't have this tapered bottom here to where it fits flat on the nail and I mean most of them don't do that and it gets it completely flat but you also have a room to move like you have room to move your product and you want to make sure that when you're putting this on that you're not touching your skin or anything but let's go ahead and get started and see what we come up with first of all you want to size them and I'm going to be using this one on my thumb and it does have the numbers on the bottom this is a number two so I'm just going to go ahead and do this Now this kit doesn't come with a slip solution so you can uh, use um, alcohol if you like. Maybe like 70% is usually what I use of alcohol. That way it doesn't break down the poly gel or anything like that. But today I'm going to use this slip solution. Now I don't know how it will react with it but if this is the Yoyogi slip solution for poly gel. And I'm going to try it out and see how well it works. Now Never seen a bean red in my life until Gershon and absolutely adore it. So you're going to turn your dual form around and you're going to squeeze the product out. Now since it's the thumb, you're going to squeeze it a little more than usual. About like that. 
maybe just a tad bit more because we want to make sure we have enough to um, you know actually I like to go ahead and just do all of mine get them ready because that way I don't take as much time but we're just going to go and put some in each one just like this And if I feel like it needs more, then I'll add more to it, but. Now, I see, I don't really see a need in using the spatula side because uh, unless you're actually sculpting it out yourself. Uh, like I said, it doesn't take that much, guys. I know in videos it looks a lot, looks like it's a lot more than, you know, in camera because cameras make things look so enlarged. But honestly, it's not. So, as you can see, there is pretty full. Like, right there is the poly gel right there. So, there's not that much air in these tubes right there. All right, so let me make sure my light's on. All right, so I'm going to pat these out and I'll be right back.
All right, guys, so what I'm doing here, after I filed the edges and the back part, sometimes when using dual forms, it can create bubbles near the back. So what I've done is filed off the back part and I'm just adding a little bit more of the bean red to the back part of my cuticle. And I am just gonna blend that into my cuticle and pull this down the nail. So that way there will be no air bubbles or any chances of lifting or anything like that. But you just fill it in and it blends in beautifully. Um, once you do this and you cure it and everything, honestly, like you can't even tell that you even add poly gel to it. But that's usually what I do. And a lot of times where I don't put my dual forms all the way back to my cuticles, I, um, if I don't get close enough, then I just fill that part in. So that way I don't take any chances of um, getting any allergic reactions. So, you know, you might want to keep that in mind if you like doing the dual form to not uh, place the product so uh, close to your cuticle. Leave enough room to where you can file and add more to it. Um, just make sure that you keep that clean, wipe all the dust off and dehydrate that back part. Uh, or add a little bit more, a little bit more base coat to adhere the polite gel. Go ahead and do that before applying. All right, so we're going to go ahead and I'm going to add the base coat to all of the rest of these nails here. So let's go ahead and do that, and I'm like going to let you watch the rest of the video.
so this is what it looks like this is the bean red with the dual forms i think they turned out beautiful i absolutely love them love these dual forms too so don't forget go check this product out i'll have it linked down below in the description box for you guys but anyways hope you guys enjoyed the video let me know what you think down below if you've used this product or not and i hope everybody's having a blessed day don't forget to comment like and subscribe while you're here let's be friends and do nail art together and i love you all um guys don't forget as well to check out my codes down below i have a few codes for you to use for the nail junkie and the maniology but anyways guys i love you all have a blessed day bye